Yo, 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 what's going on, y'all? This is your boy, MC6 Kicks, man, checking in with another detail review. I know it's been a minute, but I'm back for a cool, quick minute. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into it. Today, we're going to be looking at a, uh, a LeBron 18. Physical size is a nine and a half. In my opinion, this is my personal opinion. If you do plan on copping this shoe, please go true to size, and uh, I believe you'll be perfectly fine. If you can try them in on store, you know what I'm saying, do what you can do. Just mask up as needed with the coronavirus still on the uh, still on our radar. But uh, other than that, man, uh, let's go ahead and get into the shoe. But right before we get into the shoe, let's get into the colorway. Official colorway is black, white, black, white, university red. This is the LeBron 18 box, the dopest box other than the uh, LeBron 2 box. And it's just kind of hard topping the LeBron 2 box, in my opinion. Super dope box. The gray reminds me of the, the area of 03 when a lot of shoes was coming in these brown boxes. So kind of dope that Nike, you know what I'm saying, gave us a little bit of that flavor. But y'all didn't come to see the box, man. Y'all came to see the kicks. Bang, bang. There we have it, man. Already laced up, loose lace, ready, you know what I'm saying, to go at it. This is a bread colorway, man. In my opinion, this shoe reminds me so much of the Zoom generation, which is crazy, you know, from the heel counter to the colorway to the silhouette itself. It just, it's a complete mock-up of the Zoom generation. That's not a bad thing, in my opinion. I think it's pretty dope that uh, Nike was able to bring it back out, you know what I'm saying? Well, bring out the 18, but still give us, you know what I'm saying, cues of the LeBron Zoom generation because that was a shoe that, you know what I'm saying, kicked off his, his career. So with that being said, man, let's go ahead and get into the shoe. Starting out with the sole of the shoe, man, we're going to get into the traction, man. This is for all the hoop heads out there because if you're rocking these off court, this really don't do you no know, justice. But if you hoop it in these, let's go ahead and get into it. It does have like a milk crate pattern to it, symbolizing something that came on a Zoom, gener Zoom LeBron, the Zoom Soldier 3. So predominantly white sole. So if you're going to rock these on court, man, I think you'll be gripping and snagging everything on the court. But if you're going to rock them off court, then just taking the fact you will have to keep these clean if you want that. That store-bought university white, I call it so. So, you got mostly predominantly black. I mean, white. You just got hints of red here, here. You got the OG logo right there. Crown with the logo. You got one right here. And then eight right there symbolizing the 18. Full-length zoom. Kush line in the midsole. And then also uh, Air Max in the heel. And this is the shoe right here, man. This bat on it reminds me of something off of a dragon. I'm not sure what the inspiration is besides it taking cues from the zoom generation. But it, this 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 prime net, this battle net, this this knit posit, whatever it is, it reminds me of scales, as well as you know what I'm saying the heel counter. I meant the sole of the shoe looks like bumps off a lizard or a dragon or something like that. But uh, this is the shoe, man. Predominantly black shoe, white sole, just hints of university red. You got a red pull tab in the back. You got the crown and the logo. I'm not sure what this says. If you do know, please comment in the section below. Not sure what this is, man. These are very comfortable, super comfortable. Like I said, if you if you were that nine and a half, please snag that nine and a half. White laces with the red with the red tip. Man, this white swoosh on the toe box is super fire. You got the red signature right there, air right here, and then the OG lion's head. And yes, these are air pockets in the tongue. They're only there for looks. I don't think they do the shoe any justice as far as performance wise but i could be wrong because this this tongue is pretty thin thin so it could make the shoe somewhat lighter in my opinion white swoosh on the inner portion of the shoe and then once again that red pull tab and then on the inside of the shoe at the lebron logo you got f for force s for speed p for power and then you got the number 18 in there with the red swoosh and then here's the other shoe before we end this review man don't want it to run too long once again, this is the dopest colorway in my opinion. I like the 18 silhouette over the 17. It just looks like more of a casual shoe. As you can tell, I already got them loose laced up, so they ready for whatever, you know what I'm saying? I'm not sure if I'm going to hoop in these yet because this shoe is actually too heavy for my style of play, but who knows, man? Who knows? Who knows? But getting back into the shoe, man, super dope, man. Like I said, this this pattern reminds me, this this knit posit, this this prime knit, whatever this material is, because I haven't done this in a long time. So please don't get in the comment section and butcher me for calling Nike, get Nike and Adidas, you know what I'm saying, spec mixed up. But this pattern reminds me something off of a dragon or a snake or something. So let me know what y'all think of the inspiration. Let me know what y'all think of the shoe. I think it's super dope. Uh, I traded my LeBron 17s in for these and I got additional 20% off because of some coupons I had. So I got these for like 100 bucks and 81 cents out the door. So that was a good price because the LeBron 
the LeBron uh, 17 that I did have, I wasn't going to wear it. I was going to actually try to sell it or trade it. So I think I kind of won on this one. Let me know what you think about that trade. But other than that, man, here's the sole of the shoe. And then that right there about wraps it up, man. But here is my opinion on the LeBron 18 super dope shoe. I think it'll be a beast on court just as well as off court, depending on the colorway that you get, you know, to each his own on the colorways. But other than that, man, I'm going to get up out of here. Five minutes has been long enough for a detailed review. But uh, if you like the video, subscribe, you know what I'm saying, and uh, hit that like button and drop a comment in the section below. Oh, yeah, before I end, does anybody know what this means? I just know it's a swoosh, F-L-Z. Is it flight, LeBron, Zoom? I don't know. I don't know. Let me know what that means. But other than that, I'm going to get up out of here. Appreciate everybody for uh, checking out this review, and I'll uh, catch you on the next one real soon.